Hey Denture fam, it's me again, your favorite denture. Just kidding. Okay, today I want to talk about um, my lower dentures. Um, in my last video, I talked about how my lower dentures were very, um, they're very dull. They're, they were a very cheap pair of dentures. They're nothing like my Russell Klein dentures, um, which Russell Klein, when he makes his dentures, he makes them either with keratin or acrylic. I have the keratin ultra thins, and he sends you a packet in, in the mail, and you get three shades. You get the lightest, which is like a bleach A1, and then you get two other shades. Well, like I said in my last video, um, my real color of my teeth were an A1, so I matched the closest for my for my false teeth. Um, now, my lowers I've had for about three years, and I want to say that the teeth. Let's wash our hands so I can poke inside my mouth here. these dentures, the teeth are not separated. The teeth are made actually by just acrylic. Basically, um, the teeth are not separate, so when these dentures were made, and that's how they're able to sell them for such a cheap price, is because the palate or the part of the horseshoe on the lower is made by pink acrylic. Then the teeth are made by white acrylic. And this type of denture, the teeth wear down really quick. Um, they get really dull really fast, um, especially if you've been wearing them as long as I have. I wanted to kind of get up and close and personal with the bottom denture here and show you kind of what they look like. Um, and it makes it really hard to eat salad or, you know, steak or pork chops. Now I can still eat them. I have no problem eating anything um, other than you know certain types of candies and stuff that stick to my palate um, just because it's sugary and it will stick um, but it makes it difficult to actually chew the food because the teeth are so worn down they are so filed down so I want to get up close and personal here with my bottom denture and um, the second part of this video is going to be me applying my denture liner, comfort lining on the lower. Um, I figured I'd make a video today um, on uh, how to apply it on the lower denture, even though there are other videos that are similar uh, doing the same thing. But um, all these videos help. Okay, here we go. And as I stated before in my other video, uh, previous video that I do not I never got my 12 year old molar so I am short okay so see how the eye teeth how the teeth are worn the teeth should be shaped like these they should be sharp uh, not too sharp or they're gonna cut your tongue if you go like that over them but they should be sharp enough to where they'll cut your food when you're trying to eat not like this I also noticed um, after I had these made that It's not even. See how this tooth sticks in the middle? Mm -hmm. 
see how these are sharp, the eye teeth and sizers are compared to the bottom. So if your dentures look similar to mine, where there's no shape, they're just flat, um, straight across, it's time for a new pair of dentures. Um, a lot of things, a lot of problems can come up with a flat and all these are. Basically, think about trying to cut something with a knife, like say you're in your kitchen and you're cutting up vegetables or, or something. That's how your dentures work. Um, if you've got a dull knife, you're not cutting stuff up. Um, now what happens when your dentures are dull? There are problems that, that happen when your dentures are dull. Not just, you know, not being able to chew your food up properly. Um, when you're not able to chew your food up properly, your food doesn't get digest, like, you know, it doesn't get broken down as well by your stomach. So, what does this cause? This causes indigestion, um, acid reflux, um, bowel problems, um, can cause constipation. I'm not trying to be gross, but this is what happens. And I don't think a lot of people know this, but um, you can look it up. If you're not chewing your food properly, you're going to get a lot of issues, stomach issues. Um, I get heartburn daily. Um, I, I try to cut up, you know, if I'm eating meats or, you know, even salads, um, you know, just to cut, you know, up smaller pieces if your dentures are dull. Um, now, say you did not have, you do not have the money to go and just buy another pair of dentures. Um, I don't recommend this, but there is options. Um, now you can go and get a file and you can gently file around these teeth and make them, you know, sharper where they're able to cut. Uh, these, there's really nothing you can do with them. Uh, see how these teeth are separated how they're an actual separate tooth these are not these are acrylic teeth so when you go to cheaper places to get your dentures done say oh wow I found where I could get a whole set full set of dentures made for three four hundred dollars you know, a lot of people do this, but your teeth are going to wear down quicker. Um, cheaper the denture, the quicker they wear down. Um, my old upper before I bought the Russell Klein was the same way. Um, the teeth were so worn down that the front teeth or half the size of the front teeth here. And naturally, my front teeth are very long. So when I got these teeth from Russell Klein, um, I couldn't get used to them at first. I thought they were too long. Um, I thought I looked like a rabbit in the face, a bunny uh, with the long front teeth. But it wasn't the denture, it was me, because after wearing a cheap denture for so long, your face adjusts, you know, and your gums adjust to how long the teeth. I had to actually learn how to say certain words again after getting these, because your tongue, you know, knows where the teeth are. And when I put in a new pair of teeth, um, my tongue didn't know what to do when I would speak. So, but uh, I just wanted to go over this a little bit with everyone. Um, hope I don't look any more like a bunny anymore. <laughs> um, 
I will be getting lower dentures made, like I said previously in my previous video, uh, by Russell Klein. I'll be getting um, them made, but I will be getting the acrylic um, lower denture because I like to wear the liner on the bottom. My gums are still very sensitive, even after wearing dentures for a long time. Um, they get very sensitive still, so, um, you know, just right now I don't have anything on the lower. I just took my liner off to change it so I could show you guys. Um, so, and I feel like I have a sore spot um, already coming about, so. Alright, I'm going to go heat my water. And I'm going to let my product that is heat activated uh, sit in the hot water for about 10 to 15 minutes and then I'll be right back. Right now I'm just doing my mold uh, for my liner that I was telling you about. liner actually helps for them to sit a little bit higher um, as you can tell from before how they were sitting lower um, the liner actually sits them up higher where they need to be I like leaving a little bit of that liner on um, unless it's really thick then I will trim it but when I leave a little bit on like I did here it uh, it actually creates like this pillow for my gums um, and lifts the denture up a little bit um, and I don't have to worry about it floating around in my mouth as you can see it's stabilized so um, it creates a section mm, and just now it's comfortable um, I already have it on my upper so I don't know if you can see up in there so, um, if you have any more questions or if you have any questions I I know uh, there was a couple of questions um, on my last video, um, I'll answer them for you the best of my knowledge. But my teeth fit really well now. But this is about my lower denture, and I will be doing more videos about dentures and types of dentures. Um, I think my next video is going to be um, maybe about dry mouth or something. Um, I really like, I know there's a couple different mouthwashes out there, but I really like this mouthwash. I don't know if you can. Um, it's really expensive. Um, it's like $12, $13 for at 16 ounces so but it doesn't burn um like a lot of out like a lot of mouthwashes do i don't it has no alcohol so that's probably why it doesn't burn um and it you know it helps with dry mouth so i really like it my mouth feels overall clean so there is a product that i am uh wanting to try as well um that I will be trying another product like this that I will be trying soon and I can't wait 
to uh, try that one soon. Well, I will not keep you on this Saturday. I hope you're having a beautiful day today. Um, it's, it's a really nice day outside today. It's not too hot, not too cold. It's just perfect. So I hope everybody is enjoying their day and I will let you go and we'll see you next time.